Hello everyone, so this is a quick comparison regarding mining uh, in between the Gigabyte Vision RTX 3090 and the Gaming Trio 3090. So right now I'm uh, only running the uh, MSI. And uh, it does well, so th this rate it does fluctuate in between like uh, 11, 12, up to like I've seen, uh, I think it was like 18, 19 dollars per, per day. Normally, it sits around like I would say like 12, 13. So it runs at around 117, uh, sometimes like less maximum, I've seen like 118. And the settings right now, I'm using the MSI Afterburner and uh, I've also tried the Precision. I do find the MSI Afterburner being like the best overclocking tool right now. So as you can see in here, the power limit it is set at 80, temp limit, uh, it goes uh, Right now it's, it's 75, it's automatically will adjust depending on the power limit you set. And the uh, core clock minus 300 and memory clock plus 950. Fan speed, I do have a personal curve and uh, right now it is on auto. It runs pretty, pretty good. So I, I pre pretty much found this settings being like the sweet spot for this. I can also go to up to I think was like 1100 memory clock uh, I've also tried like a thousand, a thousand fifty uh, nine hundred, really there is not much difference like uh, I find this like working like the best like minus 300 uh, core clock and plus 950 the temps stays really good like 49c and uh, it has pretty much like, I guess the best performance. Now the vision right now it is packed. Um, I decided to uh, probably give up this one, um, but I had the, the vision running for a couple of days as well. And it was doing uh, around, I think 105. It is stable at 105, the vision and uh, The afterburner settings were around, uh, like very similar actually, very similar, very similar to this, but uh, the performance was like, uh, probably I would say maybe like a seven, eight percent less. So I decided to just keep the MSI and uh, give up the, the gigabyte it is a very beautiful card though that this gigabyte I'm just gonna show it for a moment it is a it is such a beautiful card to be honest I think it's it may be one of the best looking has this nice silver metal, it is, it is metal, I'm not sure if it's aluminium or, uh, or if it's, uh, what it is, but it's not just like, uh, uh, it, it really helps with heat dissipation.
it has some uh, the, the gigabyte LED will, will light up as well although if you do like LED kind of stuff it's just the, the MSI it's uh it is cooler <laughs> I like better the MSI to be honest. I'm not a huge fan of LED in general. Okay, just uh, if you wonder what the uh, PC case is, I just installed the other day. It is the Thermaltake T600, the Terminator T600. <laughs> it is a very cool case. There is a ton of space in here. I do plan to uh, to fit maybe another at least one if not two extra cards probably uh, I, I'm kind of limited by the power supply I have a thousand watts power supply uh, right now is this uh, Seasonic 1000 uh, I can run two 390s with this power supply but I, I won't be able to run three obviously So here it is. So from my experience, again, comparing this Gigabyte uh, 3090 uh, Vision with the 3090 Gaming Trio, it is 7-8% uh, probably uh, less uh, less performance on the on the Gigabyte. Okay, so let's check this again right now. The uh, MSI is doing 1377 USD per day. Still settings in here. Still running at pretty much the same uh, speed, 117.500 and so so. Not very hot in here. Like with this case, it's pretty much like an open case. Like a, there's like plenty of uh, of air flowing out in and out. Okay. Now, if you wonder, the motherboard I am using it is the ASUS Z490, which is a. Uh, I, I I put together this probably like a, maybe half year ago now in the autumn. 2020. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, I like. I, lo I love this cool power button. It's just uh, very nice. Maybe I should. Uh, I'm not a huge fan again of uh, too many like uh, Christmas uh, tree type PC cases. This is uh, one of the reasons I also got uh, uh, this black version. There's also a white version. It looks very nice as well. Although this is a very big, uh, fairly big. Uh, case it's 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 huge it is uh if you wonder how big it is let me see okay so i'm just gonna use this major shape so it is pretty much from if i measure like pretty much the bottom would be what is it like almost 70 70 centimeters 70 centimeters or 28 inches and high it is uh, 80 centimeters or two feet it is a full K full tower like comparison ATX uh, and again there is like a, so much space in here you can put like uh, three radiators if you want I plan to put one one card in here like that using a uh, probably the first uh, slot in there right now I'm using the, the mid one this uh, Z490E has, comes with, with uh, 3 PCIe I'll be using the middle one and the first one I'll hook up the first one right on top and uh, I may even add the third one and think maybe add the third one somewhere in there in the front if there is enough space. I'll be adding a couple of fans as well. 
and we'll see how it goes. Yeah, if, if, if I manage to keep the temps on on a uh, on a decent level. So let's check this again. Still running at one seventeen. Thirteen seventy two USD at this point. The CPU, if you if you're wondering that I'm using it, is the i7 10700K. Uh, I do have it slightly overclocked, like thirty percent. That's not obviously the best uh, option if you have a mining ring. Mine is like a it's like gaming mining a mixture, although. If you don't use the computer too much, like well, if it's in a sleep mode but still running, or uh, doesn't really matter. I don't think the processor uses any, just a minimal amount of power, so probably it's not gonna make any difference. And uh, uh, the reason that uh, pretty much I, I decided to uh, to build a computer was was gaming in mind, although I'm not gaming so much either. But I just like like to have like a uh, powerful machine, I guess. But yeah, I'm hoping maybe like in a half year or so, if everything goes well and nothing changes and uh, the mining is still the same, maybe I should be able to pay for the GPUs and then I'll just have them for free. Uh, this if I run in 24-7, which pretty much in the last couple of days I did, I had them running uh, just one, uh, like 24, 24 hour per day and it's uh, really no issues, like with these settings running uh, at 49, uh, 48, 49 degrees Celsius, it, it is uh, it is it is good, it's, it's probably, if I game and I put like everything on ultra, it's probably much more stress on the GPU than it is when you mine with it. So it is a uh, these fluctuations when you're gaming, it, they are much uh, unhealthy for the GPU than a than a healthy, steady environment that the mining does. Of course, this can be pushed more. You can uh, you can get a, a bit more, squeeze a bit more from it. But again, I'm just uh, one, uh, I'm hoping to keep them. It's it's like a long term. Uh, investment so I'm not using uh, I, I rather just keep a like low temp and uh, safer uh, settings than just uh, try and squeeze everything off from it uh, right now again it is going for like um, over 13 13 USD so the plan is to to get another 39 MSI and just uh, run two MSI's together uh, just to have them do the same pretty much uh, and since the MSI also slightly runs slightly better, I kind of just want to do that. The Gigabyte instead, the, giga, the Gigabyte guys was uh, was pretty good though. It was pretty uh, pretty silent. Actually, it was more silent than the uh, the MSI one. The fans on this one, uh, although th this is actually a, a small. These are like 90, 90 millimeters, and this is eighty, and. Uh, Overall, as a length, lengthwise, I think it's almost the same. They are like, uh, this is like 3200 millimeters, and that one I think is very similar. And height-wise, the height-wise, height-wise is uh, the MSI. It is a bit uh, bigger, but otherwise, lengthwise they are very really similar. However, the MSI has all three fans are, are 90 degrees, 90 millimeters. But for some reason, it is, it is a bit louder. The fans on the MSI. It is louder so if you care about that I guess uh, 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 this one should be should be a better choice so yeah pre pretty good graphic cards both like like very happy with it you can go with, wrong with any of them but if you have the chance to get your hands if you if you can afford to choose in between these two pretty not, not easy right now, as we all know. But if you can afford to choose in between these two, if you ha if you want the more silent one, the, get the the gigabyte. Uh, if you want the slightly more performance, not a huge difference, but the slightly more performance, get get the gaming 3 X. So that's my 
recommendation and uh, well that's pretty much it happy mining peace